My name is Tim Santel. I'm a special agent with the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service Office of Law Enforcement in Springfield, Illinois. I supervise the wildlife uh, law enforcement programs for the Fish and Wildlife Service in Indiana, Illinois, and Missouri. As agents with the Fish and Wildlife Service, you know, we, we routinely are investigating complex criminal investigation of, of various wildlife. You know, the part that makes our job a little different from other agencies is, uh, you know, we're talking about wildlife. We're talking about crimes that occur out in the wild, and there's not always a witness to those crimes. When, when, the, when the undisclosed informant first provided the information to me in this investigation. There, okay, so there's gonna be four tigers. Right. Well, I was fairly skeptical about the fact that there were actually people uh, killing big cats in cages. How could people take these animals and shoot them in a cage. Uh, how barbaric. How, how inhumane. Uh, what a lack of understanding and how magnificent these animals are. We accumulated all kinds of evidence in Operation Snowplow. Uh, Evidence ranging from you know, eyewitness accounts of killings. You know, we collected, after the bad guys left, we collected shell casings. We collected blood from the animals because we wanted to do DNA to confirm that the animals they killed were indeed either tigers or leopards. For Operation Snowplow, I was asked to give testimony of my findings. All of the evidence that was collected, I was asked to identify those animals. We analyzed the mitochondrial DNA, uh, in fact, the DNA sequence of the mitochondrial DNA, that told us that both the blood and the meat evidence submitted to us for, for analysis originated from tiger. 